Okay, silly me, I wasn't recording. So, uh, we're in the middle of the night, and uh, we're just going to do a little bit of maintenance here. We're uh, rested up a little bit, enough to, to do some work, and still get lots of sleep. So, let's, let's go to our inventory here. Oh, we got lots of antibiotics, that's really good. Antiseptic, should I should say. Let's look at our clothing, rank it by order of... Uh, Bad the condition is, and we need to repair these if we possibly can. Uh, and we're going to need, we're going to need a piece of cloth. We have, or a piece of uh, cured leather, so uh, we can get that from these things, I think. Actions, harvest, we get two cured leathers. Excellent. So we're going to do that. We're doing this at night time because then, when, uh, we don't uh, get too fatigued or anything, and we're fresh for a new start during the day. And repair. Here we go. And you can see the little icons down on the left. We're getting a little bit hungry and a little bit thirsty. So that was good. And let's see what we brought them up to. They're 93%. That's excellent. So they're in really good condition, and we don't have any more cloth, but we do have a bit of leather left. So let's go take a look at our status. And we got about 12 hours. We've survived for uh, one day in 17 hours, so we still got about, uh, we subtract 9 off of 17 hours, we got 8 hours of darkness left. So that's how we calculate the darkness when there's a storm or, or a blizzard outside and we can't tell what, what time it is from the stars or from the sun. Okay, so let's uh, go have a snack and eat some of this meat and drink this. We're going to need to make water very soon. getting very thirsty so that is going to have to be a priority right away so I think there's about eight hours of so we'll rest for about six hours and see how that does we rested for four or earlier uh, there's two wolves that I shot outside I harvested one of them and cooked it up and then the uh, wind came up and uh, we lost some firewood. Uh, okay, and we need, we need water in the worst way. We're getting dehydrated. I tend to mumble when I'm thinking out loud. See what I see there. I'm not seeing that pop I need though.
chill's only minus three, so we should be able to have a fire here. Two liters. Hopefully the wind doesn't get too bad here. And hopefully that will get us warmed up. And we'll have some water to drink. And then we can harvest, hopefully we can harvest this uh, hungry but we're really thirsty. Let's have a drink. soon as we can. We weighed it down, we got a lot of meat on us, but that's a good problem to have. A little bit cold. Mm, this will come in handy. Get indoors, we'll get warmed up. Probably useful. Keep those gloves, tear them down later, put cloth with them so we got stuff to repair with. That's always handy. Okay. Find the door, here we go. We 
have less than one hour of daylight left, but we're not too fatigued, so we're gonna go and cook that meat. Uh, we're kind of thirsty, and okay, so, so let's take care of that business. Let's take a look at our. So this is uh, 21% and. Twenty six percent, twenty one percent. How good can you navigate in the dark? place like the back of my hand so you find these things follow it down and we'll come to the fire barrel which is the around here see your firewood break that down I need some light Take a look and see what we've got for low condition torches. Well, that one's ruined. So that's the one. Fires is always a slow business. I think we've got about five or six kilograms of meat, chunks of meat to cook. So six, that's about an hour. Uh, that's about uh, two hours. Okay. Find those planks. six pieces. Getting thirsty. I'm hungry. So we'll pause for a second and take care of that.
We've got four chunks. That's going to take an hour and 20 minutes. We need to add more fuel. And that, that's about right. That'll give us a torch left over afterwards. This meat's in rather poor condition because we had to leave it overnight. It it went it really lost a lot of condition there. That's how uh, the recent changes in the game have meant that meat really degrades quickly. So that's three pieces. And we still have oh well that's four pieces and this is the fifth piece. So we should just finish our cooking. Uh -huh. We don't need to heat that up. Uh, we still have 29 minutes, so I guess we can take a torch over there. Head upstairs. While we're here, we should drop off, drop off these hides and guts we've been carrying around now for quite a while. And that's not too smart. It should have dropped that a long time ago. Okay. I'm not going to worry about building those uh, bandages because I'm going to do that because we're going to have to do some more crafting anyway soon. Now uh, there's some flies here. That looks like a empty beer bottle or something. Oh, I think it's a bottle of water. I don't know. It ended up being useful. Yep. Pork and beans, we'll just leave that. Wouldn't it be nice to find a uh, a can opener. And there's a down ski jacket. We'll grab that. And tucked over there. There's a hunting rifle. So now we've got two of them. And a thin wool sweater. So we'll hang on to that. Seems to be an empty can. Let there be an opener over here. Okay, we're fairly tired and it's about seven hours of darkness. Our condition is 86%. We'll have no problem fixing that. Uh, we just need to drink a little bit and we should be fine. cooked up to 96%. So in that overnight period, we lost 96, 76. So we lost quite a bit of condition. It was down to 24% when we cooked it. So so in, uh, in the space of that many hours, we lost 75% uh, condition. So that's significant in just one day overnight. So keep that in mind. Let's take a look at our clothing here before we head off to Slumberland. And uh, these could use repairing. Basic winter coat 2.7. Downfield 
1.5 which is thinking this much better so we're gonna just we're gonna drop that off we're gonna wear this it's not worth repairing uh, what do we have for a sweater a little sweater and another thin little sweater so let's uh, harvest that one This will bring the condition of these mittens up to 100%. And that's good. Our repair skill is up to 63, so in a, soon we'll be have enough repair skill to repair knives and axes. You really need to get your repair skill up, built up before you do that. Uh, harvest this. So it sticks out of it. We're going to harvest in the newspaper. Paper. We've only got three tinder plugs left, so we're gonna get, need to get more tinder plugs. With two sticks. We don't have a lot of stuff for firewood. Okay, let's uh, catch about six hours of rest. Before we do that, we're gonna eat, eat and drink, and we're gonna drop a lot of this stuff off. When we go outside, because we don't we don't generally carry too much food when we go outside. Uh, we're down to one liter of water, so very soon we're gonna have to make more water. So I'm gonna sign off for this episode, and we've got about five hours of darkness, so we're gonna sleep for for five and see how our condition is. If we need to sleep another hour, we can. And our condition is back up to 100%. Uh, we're still a little bit tired, so we could probably sleep a little bit longer. First, we're just going to take a little sip of water. Uh, we have about 13 hours of daylight, but it sounds kind of miserable outside. So let's take a sip of water. up to 100% and we're going to sign off for now and we'll just uh, go a little past this spot check our status see how our status is before we end the episode and we are 100% condition and we're almost totally rested so that's it